Good evening, everyone. Young Mulia Haji Muhammad Salehin, Mr. Rizwan, Mr. Muhammad Farid Abdullah, Mr. Abi, Mr. Xiang Yo, and our esteemed Taikan owners. Tonight, we are not just celebrating the Taikan, but also optimism of future of electric vehicles. We uh, celebrate World EV Day first time in Brunei. We thank you, our Taikan owners, for being the first investor of electric vehicles for the first time and believing in the pioneering spirit of Porsche, the legacy of our founder, Ferry Porsche. Since the launch of Taycan, the first all electric sports car, the world of electromobility has changed completely. For Porsche Brunei today, I am excited to announce our partnership with After Checkers Restaurant Asado that making another milestone with launch of the first ever Porsche destination charging in the nation. This place is ideally located center of Brunei Darussalam, which is en route highway to Belai district. The uniqueness and exclusivity of this place will allow for excellent exposure among our current customers and also future customers. With that, our BEF customers can now enjoy a complimentary charging and have a rest and eat while they get charged their electric vehicle. We at After Chakras are glad to partner with Porsche Brunei to introduce the first destination charger in Brunei for Porsche Taycan users. We hope that this is the first of many destination chargers that will be installed throughout Brunei and more incentives will be introduced to encourage more Bruneians towards owning an electric vehicle such as the Taycan. With that, we hope today is the start of a wonderful partnership between After Chakras and Porsche Brunei towards a cleaner and greener Brunei. The Taycan is a great leap forward for Porsche as the company works towards being the net carbon neutral across the value chain by 2030. With our clear shift towards to sustainability and electromobility and substantial investment into reducing our carbon footprint, we are already making progress. Yet, more must be done. And that's why we have come together this evening to celebrate the World EV Day, which I hope to be the first of many more to come in the future.